Hi, and thank you for joining me for today's meditation, whose theme is Anthony, hope of those who are ill. We are here inside the chapel of St. Anthony. Here we have the tomb of St. Anthony. His mortal remains rest here. And all around the chapel we have high relief showing miracles performed by St. Anthony. In this particular panel we see the miracle of the drowned girl. A poor girl from Padua went to the river, she fell inside the river and, they, and when they were able to take her out of the water she was already dead. So the mother ran to St. Anthony and asked him, implore him to help her and St. Anthony was able to give her life back. This work is by Jacopo Sansovino, sculptor and architect from Florence. And it is interesting because we can see here uh, the three phases of the life of the woman. A woman as a girl, a, a woman as a mature woman, and then as an old woman. Look at the wrinkles of that old lady. So, St. Anthony is really you know, people come here because they really feel close to St. Anthony and they hope for a miracle from him. Anthony was always very concerned about sick people, especially those who were seriously ill. And many are the miracles he performed to help them. In his sermons, he constantly recommends prayer. O oh Father, look at us because your Son Christ died for us, who were the cause of his death. And since he himself told us to ask you in his name, we beg you to give yourself to us, because without you we cannot exist. God is our Father and we are his children. This is why we daily say the prayer of our Father. He loves us very much. And this is why we should never be tired to pray to him for our needs, keeping in mind, however, that we should always ask in the name of Jesus Christ. And whatever we ask in prayer, we will receive if we have faith. Because you see, when I go and pray in my name, who am I? But if I'm going and pray to God in the name of Christ, in the name of Jesus, then all doors are open. And so now let us pray to St. Anthony. And so we pray, Dear St. Anthony, because you experience disappointments and sickness in your brief life, please intercede with God for my loved ones who are ill, so that their health may improve. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Thank you for participating and I'll see you all tomorrow for our next meeting. Have a great day.